every Sunday in the year, 52 Sundays in a year for the next five years. Today, we are going to have a lot of fun. We are going to have a lot of fun. If it were human beings, come and be the dam. Rise William Ruto Hagekuwa Ikulu. Mimi mwenye walikuwa menipagia nienda hapa kamiti. Lakini kwa sababu ya maombi na hiko mungu binguni. Today, President William Ruto ambaya likuwa nauza kuku, diyo rais wa Kenya and commander in chief of the defense forces. Demere gai itu ke? Anggai dari lagi ma? Ina tak kau makan yole? Wajue awa, awa di sini mahu kau na sistem, mahu kau na deep state, mahu kau na DCI, mahu kau na machief, mahu kau na pesa, sisi tu kau sema tu kau na monyet mungu na wanaish. Suri washinda tu washinda. Because our watu walikuwa na kiburi wa mesa hawa hata hiko mwenyezi mungu. Walikuwa wanajisikia wakiwa na nguvu. Walikuwa naongea vile wanataka. Tulienda hapa keno. Hui waziri yalikuwa wa usalama. Alikuwa mwenye kiburi. Akatuma polisi kanisani wakatupa tear gas kwa mabisho. Ate OSPD hameingia, hamechukua microphone kwa bishop. Hapa kwa madhehebu. Kwa madhehebu. Kwa madhabahu. On the altar, they discreted the church of Christ. And God had to teach them a lesson. But it doesn't matter how powerful they were. They felt very powerful. They were talking arrogantly. Waliita mkutano pale sagana Stot Lodge Wakatukana hao wanabi They insulted anointed men and women of God Na kuatisha Ati wataeda jenamu Na kusema ati wanapenda pesa Kwa hile kiburi walikuwa nae Nae mungu wakaonesha ya kwamba Mungu diyo ako kwa kiti cha ufalme na ufalme wote mungu diyo atafanya delegation God will delegate other leadership but he is the ultimate leader of the world and mankind na mimi nataka niseme huyu bishop wenu tumweshimu siku tumeshinda kabula hatu jaingia pala ikulu tukasema lazima maaskofu wafike kwanza waombe Diyo hile pepo mbaya na mashetani likuwa huko yondoki Kati ya wale mabishop walifika pale ni huyu bishop mwai Na tangu wali yomba huko kumekua kusuri Ni maendeleo tu inaendelea Ata ba ilikuwa huko tukafunga Sasa numesha zikia ba kwa state house Sasa ukiweka ba kwa state house Kuna kasi naeza fanyika Mimi mwenyewe Nilipo ingia kwa ofisi yangu kabla sija ingia pale harabe house annex Huyu bishop mwai na mba bishop wengine wakakuja wakaomba Dio nikapata baraka kwa hiyo ofisi Wiki iliopita siku ya jumane Kwa sababu tunataka kuenda mulima na rais pale sagana street lodge Bishop mwai na wengine tukawaomba waende huko Kwa sababu hapo dio ilikuwa imejaa uchochezi na fitina na pombe Wakaenda pale Sagana State Lodge Wakaomba sasa tuko tayari Kupeleka rais Sagana State Lodge Aanze kazi kutoka huko Kwa hivyo bishop sisi tunashukuru Raisa meniambia Mambo ya shambayenu Anashugulikia mwenyewe Na ni mwenyewe atakuja hapa Hakimaliza kutangaza Kwa hivyo tu mungoja kidogo Iyo maneno ilikuwa imeenda sana Lakini hiko kwa laini inaendelea Nikimalizia wa kristo tunasema asanti tufanya kazi vile bishop wamesema 
Awa watu napanga maandamano Atibei ya unga yuko juu Sisi tukiingia tulikuta unga 230 Tumengangana imetremuka wale ite inaendelea chini Hawa watu walipora nchi hii Pesa yote ya Kenya In the next few days I will be releasing details of billions of shillings looted from the public coffers in the last three months of the Uhuru administration and announce the ministers and PSs responsible so that Kenyans can know. Pesa ya Kenya yote sa ile waliona uchaguzi mearibika walibeba na magunia Ata hii petition huyu mzee ya, ya maandamano hakuwa nataka Alisukumwa aweke petition To allow them room wakati ya Supreme Court inasikiza kisi Waibe mali ya Kenya Between the time IBC announced William Ruto as president And the day he was sworn in They looted more than 24 billion shillings in this country Na hiyo kesi walijua kuna pahali naenda Ilikuwa kesi imewekwa Dio wapore mali waende Pale katika police air wing Pale Wilson Dio pesa ilikuwa naletwa na magudia Inawekwa kwa ndege Inapelekwa kwa mtu jumbani Inapelekwa kwa mungine kwa mungine In the next few days Nitatangazia wa Kenya Pesa ilienda kwa nani Kwa nani Kwa nani Kwa nani Wasi, wasi tulete sisi Sisi nilisema pale siku ya inauguration Wakasema mimi ni mjeuri Nikasema tulikuta store akuda chochote Ata panya ametoroka akuda kitu ya kukula Hii inchi tumeanza upia We have started from scratch We found a broke country with nothing The little that was remaining waliba siku za mwisho Na hawadi walikuwa naongoza kusema watu niwezi Na hao di walikuwa waezi wa, waezi wa ku Ni hile ilikuwa pale za mani Nairobi Pale ya base na hapo, hapo Kencom Wala watu ya pickpocket walikuwa na jipanga kama watu tharathini Wana kuibia Ukisema umeibiwa Wanaleuka wewe, wanasema wedi omuizi That is what was happening These fellows who kept on shouting That they cannot hand over to thieves That thieves will not be entertained in this country those are the people who have stolen money belonging to the people of Kenya. And in the few days, we shall be releasing details. Ya mwisho, imeona headline kubwa ya nation. Ati sisi, tunataka kuharibu biashara ya familia mbili. Sisi tunasema, mutugi ya gas wamekua kitusia baikali. Gas wamekua kitusia baikali because of monopoly. Tumesema tulete watu tano ine washindane Bei ya mtuli ya gazi tremuke na gazi tremuke And that is what will happen You can sponsor headlines Lakini bei ya gazi na mtuli ita tremuka We shall open up that space to many competitors Because it was a monopoly by one person Anatuzia mtuli ya gazi na gazi vile anataka Mambo ya maziwa tumesema there has been a monopoly by one person. Amenunua kampuni zote. Anatuzia maziwa, anatunuia vile anataka, anatuzia vile anataka. We are opening up that sector for competition. Diyo mkulima, aongezewe bei, na mkujo maziwa itaremuke. Na itakuwa na mnaio. Na diyo wa jamaa watu kutaka tukue tufike kwa uongozi. They knew why there was a project called Azimio. Why that fellow was being chaperoned? It is because they wanted to continue with state capture and monopoly to continue exploiting the people of Kenya. But we are saying that has come to an end. We are going to open up the milk industry. We are going to open up the gas business so that the people of Kenya can benefit. Mimi ningetaka ni malizia hapo ni seme tumeshukuru sana. Lakini nyinyi wanaume nimefurahi sana. Adwaitu. Kaitu ile ukadira ile. 
Ni tiga dore ya kadi laini ni kire hado horu Wawo kone kuo Lakini nyinyi wana ube pia Gawa na rafiki yangu You people don't take advantage Hile ni disema Hile ni disema elifu tatu ni ya pastor dokas Wewe patia mama ya kwako Hile mumezo yana Because Kama yako alikuwa na mbatia 10,000 Unajua some people now are taking advantage Because ni disema na peyaka pastor dokas 3,000 Alikuwa na patia wake tena na kupunguza Apana Pea mama hile mwriswayana And you know the constitution also does not allow you To withdraw a benefit You give what you have been doing So wewe mama Pigania aki yako Wasitumie hiyo kufija njini Hiyo ni ya pastor doka Selefutatu kwa sawa ni mubiri ya na mabo mingi Sasa wewe Depende wa uliwa Finally I want to thank you, Governor. Where to? And I tell you, Missouri. And this Governor, the way you have said, Governor, it is true. I mentored this young man. I took him, the Kamsaidia, to Kaka, and he is doing well, and I'm very happy. I have. We are mentoring Malala from Western. We are mentoring Sahil from Kisi. What maybe Wamumbi is saying? They have a problem with the mountain because the leader who was there refused to mentor young leaders so by the time he was leaving there was nobody sasa diyo huyu mwamumbi analia ni wasaidi hapa kwa mulima because yule alikata alikuwa mtu wakitoka kitoka wanachukua nyundo na kubonga and if there is one thing that the previous leader alikosaya wati ya Mount Kenya was to refuse to mentor young people and to kill those who are coming mimi na president tumekubaliana We shall mentor young leaders across the country. To Kopale, Kos, to Koda Mohamed Ali. Pale Kisi, to Koda Osoro. Pale Masaini, to Koda Armand. Pale Hapa Kwetu, to Koda Hawa Vijana, to Koda Nede Nyoro, to Koda Kebani Chorowa. Pale Ukambani, to Koda Kawaya. And you can see Vida to Meuda UDA. Party leader, Ametoka Rutvari. Deputy Party Leader ni mime imetoka hapa kwa mulima Secretary General ametoka pale Western Chairman ametoka pale Mount Kenya East Organizing Secretary ametoka Lower Eastern Treasurer ametoka pale Kisi Ours is a national party And we shall mentor these young people These young leaders We shall prepare them for leadership And the Governor is my person Mime ndiyo nilimulete hapo ni memusaidia And I am happy the way he is going. Now we are there. But if I find Pahali, we are going to go. 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 So you are going to go. It is like that because me, Mr. Sasa, and Baba Wenu, I am going to go. Pahali, I am going to go. 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 And the governor, to Mr. Kisana, and now things are moving well. And we'll continue mentoring these young leaders, correcting them where we need to correct them, encourage them where we need to encourage them, because that is the way to go. Kwa vivyo mimi nataka ni shukuru sana sana Bishop Mwai. And we shall come back again with the President. Na tumefurai sana vide mumetugojea. Na kwa maumbienu, na tumeshukuru. Asante ni sana. Mungu wa bariki. Thank you very much. Live pictures coming to us from Roy Sambu, from the Roy Sambu Chapel, uh, Winners Chapel, where Deputy President Rigadi Gashagwa had joined the Christian uh, faithful and was addressing them. Among other things, he mentioned that the government would find ways to lower the cost of living for its citizens. And on that note, we come to the end of Lunchtime News. Thank you so much for choosing us. I am Nisi Emano uh, Lensa Odingo has been our sign language interpreter this afternoon. Good afternoon. Enjoy the rest of your viewing.